Game week finally arrives for Mustang football. I'm Andrew Masuda with your KSBY Cal Poly Sports Minute. The Tim Walsh era officially kicks off Saturday in Spano Stadium when Cal Poly takes on Sacramento State. Tony Smith will make his first collegiate start at quarterback. Ranked 12th and 13th in the two major polls, Cal Poly scored a big win thanks to the NCAA when it granted wide receiver Dominic Johnson's appeal. The UCLA transfer will play in the opener instead of sitting out the first two games as previously thought. It will be the 31st all-time meeting between the Hornets and Mustangs. The all-time series is tied at 15 apiece. The Hall of Fame game kicks off at 4.05 p.m. The 23rd-ranked men's soccer team fell to 0-2 to start the year. The Mustangs gave up an 81st-minute goal in a 1-0 loss at number 2, ranked Creighton. It's the first time in 24 matches Paul Holliher's men suffered consecutive defeats. Cal Poly plays two tough road matches this week in search of win number one. They play at Stanford Friday, then at 8th-ranked Cal on Sunday. After dropping its first two games of the year against top-ranked opponents, the women's soccer team scored a 2-1 win last Friday against Seattle. Christina Condon-Sherwood and Morgan Miller scored for Cal Poly in the victory. The Mustangs then lost Sunday 2-1 at Cal State Bakersfield. Alex Crozier's women continue their six-game road trip with a Friday and Sunday match in Florida. Cal Poly Volleyball scored its first win of the year Sunday against Weber State at a tournament hosted by BYU. Prior to the win, the Lady Mustangs dropped the first two matches of the tournament to extend its losing streak to six. The women play Friday and Saturday in a tournament hosted by Colorado and Denver universities before finally returning home. And with this week's KSBY Cal Poly Sports Minute, I'm Andrew Masuda.